Okay guys, so welcome back. Uh, you probably noticed that I've got a bit of a buzzkill going on now. Um, the reason I haven't uploaded anything for a while is because I've moved house, I've got married, I've made, had to create a whole new workshop and everything. So I'm basically getting on with that, but I'm going to be uploading all different sorts of things in the future. So uh, there'll be a lot more workshop designs coming up, which should be great. So the first thing that I've actually created is my workbench and I need a workbench which would um, save space but also have a lot of space for me to work on because I like a big area to actually lay down on my boards and everything. So let me show you how it works. So this is the workshop uh, workbench behind workshop workshop workbench behind me. Uh, as you can see you've got these runners. Uh, these are I suppose the hinges. Um, these two things here and I've got this frame so I'm going to show you a couple of bits about it and show you how it works. So the frame itself actually the jeans are falling down. The frame itself actually is something that I use to cut big boards. So what I tend to do is if just give that a bit of a pull out like that and then fold that up. You can see that I can actually have space to put big boards on it and this will carry an 8x4 sheet um, quite easily. This is uh, it's great for me to be able to work on. And I just clamp things to the side. You can clamp it there, do a cup down it, whatever you want to actually do. Uh, and the best thing about it is that, as you see on here, it just folds down and tucks away in there like that. So nice and easy. So the other part of the work mentions, I want to show you how these hinges work. And I've got them on each side. Now the hinges actually allow my workbench, which is a four foot workbench, to extend to an eight foot workbench. Uh, very, very simple design. And I can show you a little bit more about that or you can comment and ask me any questions that you want on it. So the next part I will show you is this new design of a um, sliding fence which obviously hides under the second part of the table and all I've got is these little screw caps uh, these washers here and this runs in recessed runners just here and here with a little bit on the bottom of this piece of wood and that just slides up and down and you can obviously tighten that up with these nuts and it makes it so it's not actually going to move anywhere so that's a new design of mine. Uh, I've copied it obviously from the steel one. If any of you have seen the steel version of that, then you know what actually I'm talking about with that. Uh, so anyway, that's my workbench. So this is my full blown table saw. This one is my workbench. And as you can see, I've still got all my tools and everything just scattered around the top. I haven't got to clear the space or anything. And then when I want to put it back, just fold up the legs, a bit of a lift. And we're back to a four foot workbench, which I have a handle on the side of it. And actually roll it around and make life that a little bit easier. So that's the new improved workbench. Uh, if you have any questions or you want to comment in the section below, please do. I'll be more than happy to answer any questions and uh, please subscribe. So thanks a lot guys.